What's going on, everybody? You already know who it is. It's your boy, that guy, the dryer nude here. And today we're talking about the almighty controller. Um, it's been a while since we talked about it. It's actually the first video of the year that we're talking about controllers. And I just want to say I do not hate controller players because, heck, I'm a controller player myself. I play controller when it comes to playing on uh, game like rebirth or like uh warzone i i plug in the controller um and a lot of you might be asking why and i'm here to say that it controller in warzone and on rebirth or not rebirth but resurgence is a better input okay it's just a better input if you're trying to be super competitive it's just a better input and that's just how it is i do not think that controller however is a better input on multiplayer and i think most of the frustration comes uh from the mouse and keyboard community when it comes to controllers is warzone <clears throat> and any warzone it could be resurgence or just regular you know warzone and i don't see too many mouse and keyboard players complaining about aim assist on uh multiplayer because you die you come back you know we're not we're all going to have those days where we're not we don't have perfect aim but we can still kind of come back and reset a little bit in multiplayer but with warzone it's just not like that if you die you know that could be the potential of you just being out of the game and not able to uh win that match or just being a little off on somebody and not able to uh, come back and cost your team. And I think that's where a lot of the frustration uh, comes from, especially from a mouse and keyboard player. Uh, <clears throat> I think that controllers, yes, I, I'm here to say I do not hate. You can be a controller player. I do not hate you at all. Okay, I, I just let's throw that out the way. If you're a controller player, you know, you play on whatever input you want to play at. I think that people, and especially in my community, I want to say that we do not really care. I can speak for most of us, uh, whatever input you play on. And most of my community is smart enough to know that it is not your fault. It is the developer's fault. And, you know, you should be able to play on whatever input you want to play on. Right. Um, so there's that. Um, but that being said, I just think controller is more fun also on uh, Warzone because A, I don't have to worry about my aim too much. I don't have to worry about uh, having my shot be off and I could just work on outplaying the enemy and outsmarting the enemy. And when it comes to mouse and keyboard, you know, you got to think of all those things, but you're controlling every single input. And a lot of these videos out here I'm seeing from mouse and keyboard players and from controller players are people that just don't have the time and on both inputs and they just don't know what they're talking about <clears throat> aim assist is 100 percent needed the rot rotational aim assist maybe not so much but call of duty is a casual game and you can never really take it too seriously right they're going to appeal to the casual audience so you have to understand that um but it is really strong right now it is really strong the skill of aiming and any good controller player is going to tell you that, yeah, aim assist is a little too strong right now and needs a little bit of a nerf. But, you know, some of the mouse and keyboard community is saying, hey, this needs to be completely removed. No, not inside this. You need aim assist and you guys are going to ruin a good thing by uh, um, asking for uh, cross play to be turned off with all your cheating and everything happening on uh, PC. <laughs> Loudness, EQ, all that, which I really don't care about don't really don't think it's cheating but you also got to think of the console experience which is largely what uh the call of duty community plays on is console right you got your xbox uh, and your playstation and that's mostly what they play on um but you know that's just the community how it is most of us most people don't have time to play or buy a really good pc to get really good frames and all that most people don't even know how to set up a pc they just go to work they come home and they just play the game they want to play the game they're not ha it's not too serious and to be grant granted with you those people are protected by the elo based matchmaking or skill based matchmaking however you want to say because i would probably never run into those people uh, most of the people i run into are uh, sweats right they, they're sweaty but that's either here nor there the controller is really good but like i said i think a lot of the frustrations come from warzone and resurgence when it comes to the mouse and keyboard community complaining about controllers uh i don't really don't 
I really just don't notice it that much in multiplayer. I don't really think it's that bad, to be honest with you. And that's just me, because I can respawn, come back again. Sure, it's annoying if I get killed off of uh, a streak, but more times than not, it's my positioning and everything that got me killed, not my aim. And let's be honest, controller players, you can't really turn around really fast, right? If you want the optimal aim assist and all that. Uh, but that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Warzone gameplay in the background on uh, Vondel quads just playing on controller because I just wanted to show off and say, hey, I'm not actually BSing. I'm pretty good at controller. So, yeah, as always, guys, I hope you enjoy the video. Um, let me know down in the comment section below. What do you guys think? Huh? Always remember, stay blessed, stay humble, and I'll catch you in another video. Peace.